this is going to be the ride from Santa Elena into Bullet Tree. Santa Elena now, heading towards what they call the low bridge or the wooden bridge. Excuse me for yawning, it's been a long day. This is the diversion. If we went straight, theoretically, we would hit the Hawksworth Bridge, which was closed to two-way traffic. So now there's the diversion or the bypass that allows two-way traffic over the Hawksworth Bridge. Right? You go over to Hawksworth one way and then you come back over this way process of building a new bridge that's going to bypass this wooden bridge um, and who knows how long that's going to be before that ever comes to fruition. You build things right on the corner so you can't see until you're right on top of the intersection. No uh, line of sight easements here please. All right, here's the low bridge. You'll see why. This is the low bridge connecting Santa Elena. We're on the Santa Elena side headed towards San Ignacio. This bridge will go 15 feet underwater to the point where about the roof of the truck that's up ahead of us here in the 11 o'clock position would be underwater, typically when, the, uh, when this bridge goes underwater. Eh, not quite that far, but definitely up to the mirrors. This is the San Ignacio Market. I have to come back here in an hour and put the tent up for tomorrow. Let's run through town because it's going to be better to go this way than it will be to go up the double street. The market is on my left. And that's the busiest day is on Saturday from about 5 o'clock in the morning until about 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Up ahead on the right is the Welcome Center that houses Fuegos and Greedies and Serendibs. Coming up into the major intersection here, which is Burns Avenue, and I believe we're still on Savannah Street now, which is going to become Bullet Tree Road. Or does Savannah go in the other direction? I'm not sure which. Uh, this is like a five points intersection here. Hello. Hi. Somebody just kind of lurched in my passenger window. He wants to get a ride now. Shit. Huh? No. Good. Of course, this is the minister of some thing. Land Cruiser Prado. construction right now. People walk out and don't even look for you. And I have no idea what the hell that guy wanted to say to me, but it was either he was trying to sell me pot or he wanted a ride. Either way, I wasn't interested, so he said no. Coming up on the minister again, I don't know who the hell it is. But he's important and lost because he went totally in a way that made no sense. type of driving attitude here from New York and Philadelphia into Belize. We definitely have a more, uh, what's the, you're not a defensive driver, you're an offensive driver. You tend to put the cars where you want them to go instead of where they want you to go. You make it happen, you don't 
let it happen. Starts. Oh, he got it running. Okay. Tried to pop it up the hill. I guess the kick and the starter and everything were dead. I don't know. Flashing burn going on up here on the right. Very typical scene in Belize. Just light your property on fire and then rebuild.
got her left turn signal on like she's going to go left, but there ain't really no place that she can go left. Hello. How are you? Good. Home. I live right there. Yeah. Thank you. Police checkpoint in Belize while being followed by the police. 